Okay, so this would be my third Amazon unboxing during June 2020, so let us cut right into it. The last two unboxings, I was looking back at my phone to see what those were about. The first one, uh, that one mostly dealt with clothes from, I believe, Layer 8 and Carhartt. The second one, that had a variety of accessories and also some clothes. This one, this time, is going to be mainly about my red clothes, like the Amazon Central shirt. You can also see the new shorts in here, so, yes, oh yeah, and we're Fail! Okay, let's do this, and let us do this right this time, because this would actually be the second time this happened. I mean, you're like, well, okay, when did this happen twice? Today? Well, the first time it was off camera, but the second time it was on camera, so let's make the same focus now so it doesn't look so ridiculously blurry. You know what, let's just take this off the desk altogether. And we'll take a look at these clothes. Yeah, I've been getting a lot of things from Carl Clayton because I discovered that their shirts are just oh so awesome. Like really, if you want nice long shirts that are not just so short and dinky dinky, then this is what you get. I know, I know there are probably some other long style shirts and whatever out there as well. I'm going to look into that as well because obviously I don't only want to buy Carhartt. Like, not that there's anything wrong with them, but it's just nice to have a variety of other brands. Okay, so this one, I believe, is the one that they labeled as Coral Pink. I don't know, on camera, it looks a bit more like bubblegum pink. Oh, no, 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 I wouldn't say bubblegum pink. I wouldn't go as far as saying bubblegum pink. Bubblegum pink is a lot more vibrant. Okay, it doesn't tell us how to wash it. Yes, machine wash, warm, let me say colors. And it's 100% cotton, made in Guatemala. Okay, yes, actually this is important. Now, what some people I realized in the comments or like the Q&A were asking which of these are 100% cotton. And I think somebody from the staff did respond and say that it's select colors. So if you were wondering about which color I have to get to get 100% cotton, this is clearly one of them. As for the other colors, I do not know from the top of my head. All I would say is just select the color, read the description. If it's not there, then I'm pretty sure you can obviously just do cards and email and they'll probably be happy to let you know if it's not already on the website. I mean, I got these from Amazon. You can buy them directly from the website. I'm not sure if Amazon has the material content explicitly listed out. I believe it does, but if not, like I say, it's not too hard to figure it out. All right, so that's enough of that. Uh, okay, what do I want to toss? Actually, no, I'm just going to toss this into the laundry pile. Well, no, not entirely yet, because I'm going to put it back on the desk so we can go and examine these things. What is this? Oh, yeah. Camera's essentials. Okay, for a moment, I thought that they had them all in one package. Looks like they did not. They all come their own separate packs. And I believe I got six of these, yes. And they're a lot darker than I thought. Online, they made them look pretty bright. Like, I'd say, uh, I don't know if crimson is the right word to use, but I don't need to be bright. I don't know. Maybe it's because they're in the plastic. Well, I'll open up one of them to take a closer look. And now let me just make sure that there's six. So we're at one, two, three, four, five, six. Wow. Six red pocketed shirts. I wonder what the people in the warehouse thought when they had to deal with this order. They're like, hmm, the scam must really like these shirts or something, or who knows? Actually, wait, what were you thinking when you were packing this order? I don't think I had to tell the person that, that this is going to be watching this video. Well, maybe, maybe not. You never know. All right. Next up, I have plastic. Lots and lots of plastic. It's not bubbling this time, so I can't pop anything. Actually, wait. Why isn't it bubbly? Actually, that's a bit of a concern because, like, I mean, there wasn't anything in here that was really precious that needed that extra shock protection, but it does kind of beg the question, why weren't these inflated? 
Or were they actually inflated and then they just became deflated? I don't know. So you know what? That's really, really not important. So, I mean, well, it is to me, but to you, the viewer, you don't want to be seeing such boring things. So let's just open up one of these guys and take a closer look. Actually, right now, I am wearing a red shirt. So when I saw these online, I was expecting it to look more something like this. Like, you see that vibrant type of red? Yeah, that's the way it looked online. And when you compare this with this, you can see that this looks a bit, uh, a bit more dull, I guess I would say. I don't know if that's the best word to describe because it's not exactly super dull, but at the same time, you can tell that this is a lot more vibrant and punchy than this is. Still looks brilliant, but just not as brilliant. Now, these I did not exactly expect to wear outdoors. So I wasn't too concerned about it passing the passport test. I'm going to do it anyways, because why not? Okay, so with a bit of finessing, it can work. Actually, yeah, yeah, no, it works just fine. Okay, it's just that this flap here is going to be a problem. And then it kind of begs the question, over the long term, what's going to happen to this if I were to repeatedly keep trying to just shove it in? Would it eventually tear it? I do not know. I do not think it should be too much of an issue because these certs, they're not like some really cheap low quality like i mean price wise yes they are cheap but quality wise i get to understand they're good not like superb and just like i don't know absolutely boss or whatever for a lack of a better adjective okay so that is that should i open all of them hmm well i do not know actually yeah, i think i'm gonna do that because you know what there's a reason actually before i do just that let's take a look at some other things you know, I do the details in these unboxings. Okay, so like the other colors so far that I've done, I mean, Pakistan, 100% cotton, machine wash cold. So that means that they will be really breathable. So that's good. And you can see it in some other languages as well. All right. So I'll toss that back in the box. This one. The same ordeal, I'm not going to bother opening it or commentating on the details of whatever because that would just be extremely boring to you. I'm going to start off with these ones now. Why am I doing that? Because I know. Or who knows, maybe online it was actually supposed to be this so much darker red and perhaps I wasn't reading the description too thoroughly. I don't know. I don't have a problem with it, don't get me wrong. Like if I sounded as though I have a big problem with it, I absolutely do not. I love red, it is one of my favorite colors. The other two would be blue and green. so far i don't see any lips in them or whatever not that there should be anyways but you just never know maybe it might be slightly effective so actually what i'm doing is actually a good thing looking over them just to make sure that they're not defective or torn in any way wait did i open up those shorts i don't think i did it actually you know what yeah i wasn't spending all this time going through oh actually, okay and some time so don't worry we're gonna get to the shorts because i don't think i actually touched on those very well at all in fact, did I even actually, uh, wait, I think I might be burying them under these red shirts I'm tossing into this box. Yeah, actually I am. Okay, so good thing I just noticed that. So, okay, rather than boring you by opening all of these shirts, let's just take a moment here to look at these. Yeah, so I almost forgot about this. Now, if these look extremely familiar, well, they should, because in one of my unboxings this month, I did the red version to this. Is it from the exact same brand? I don't know. The other one had a star somewhere. 
I'm not seeing it for this one, so it looks like they're not. But to be honest, the feel and the build quality of it and all, they just seem so eerily similar. Like, it's the same. But I would not know because I don't see that star that the other one had. Okay, so 100% polyester. That means it's not going to be exactly super breathable, but at the same time, as you can tell from the mesh or whatever, it should feel really light anyway, and you should still be able to breathe because of all of these fine holes. And, yeah, stretchy as you'd expect from polyester. It did not rip, so that means reasonably good quality. Because, I mean, it would suck if you spent money on something, even if it's cheap, and it just rich from moderate force. That would be a junkie product. <laughs> yeah, I have to emphasize that. So, okay. Let's just quickly go over everything I bought. So, the red shirt, these blue mesh shorts, and the coral pink shirt. If you are interested in buying these, you probably know exactly where to go at this point right down in the comment section specifically underneath the amazon affiliate links but for those of you in canada i'll have the exact names to these products linked directly to the website so you can purchase them if you're from another country like say the states italy or spain or whatever i think that they do have them as well so you just have to take the name copy it into your country look for it from there and happy shopping now i am out